Hi, today I know that future brings you another new video. So today we will be talking about the cross on the Mount of Moon. This is the Mount of Moon and here we make a cross. Alright, so what does the Mount of Moon represent? Travel, imagination, restlessness, laziness. But the main thing, the organ it or the part of the body it represents is the stomach and the digestive system. So people with a large Mount of Moon mostly suffer from digestive issues but people with not an enlarged but a normal or underdeveloped amount of moon don't suffer from these tendencies but if there is a cross so that means that there is a lesser chance for people with a less developed amount of moon to suffer or not suffer at all but most of the time 80% of the time when there is an enlarged amount of moon and there is a cross on it that means that the person suffers from a digestive disorder and very constantly so he has to like he or she has to avoid fast food, oily food, have a good diet, eat more yogurt and such stuff. Again, you can go to the doctor, I am only a promised. But again, if they control this habit, like if they control themselves, control overeating and everything, and if there are other good signs present, like a square on the lifeline, and if the lifeline is very fulsome and very good, and there is also a good mercury line, which also represents health, going towards there, and this mount of Venus in the, is enlarged, so these tendencies can be reversed. So again, as I said, that the cross or any other sign are not permanent; they can disappear over time. The lines are, are ever changing; only the ha hand shape and size remains constant. So if you, even if you have this cross your whole life, but you are careful with your health, then nothing bad will happen. Also, uh, in ancient monastery, they said maybe a cross on the mount a moon or a star on the mount of moon represents death by drowning drowning this is not the case back then there were aside from there were also what do you say there were diseases which could not be cured by medicine at that time and the palm tree at that time was very influenced by fatality fatalism but now as science has progressed and that and these indications were also a bit dumb because like Suppose the person never ever enters water. So that's why modern pomists have assigned the cross and the areas, the regions of the hands to digestive systems or body parts because they are always with the human subject. So again, n at no way anything represents death by drowning or death by hanging. So thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a nice day.